Today I'm going to show you why the derivative of arc cosine of x is equal to negative 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared. Okay, so let y equal arc cosine of x. What we're going to do is we're going to take the derivative of y. But we don't know how to evaluate the derivative of arc cosine of x. I mean, we hope that this is going to be the final answer. So what we're going to do is evaluate the cosine of both sides. So we have cosine of y is equal to x, right? Cosine of arc cosine of x is just x. And now we'll hit both sides with the derivative. So the derivative of cosine of y is equal to the derivative of x. Another way to say that is negative sine of y times y prime is equal to 1. Or y prime is equal to negative 1 over sine of y. But what's sine of y? We want our answer to be in terms of x. Okay, so we're going to use the fact that cosine of y equals x to help us get sine of y. So consider the right triangle with angle y. We know sine of y is equal to x. Well, let's write it as x over 1. Okay, so, oops, we don't know that sine of y equals x over 1. We know cosine of y is equal to x over 1. So cosine of y is adjacent over hypotenuse. So we have cosine of y is x over 1. We could get the opposite leg using the Pythagorean theorem. So let's call this a. And we know a squared plus x squared equals 1 squared. Solving for a, we have a is equal to the square root of 1 minus x squared. Okay, and so we could get sine of y. Sine of y is equal to opposite over hypotenuse. Putting this all together, we have y prime is equal to negative 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared. So there you have it. That's why the derivative of arc cosine of x is equal to negative 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared. And you could do a similar thing with all the other inverse trig functions, arc sine, arc tangent, and so forth. Well, let me know what you think. Uh, I love these types of videos. And by videos, I mean questions, um, because it, it eliminates the memorization part of calculus. All right. See you later. Bye-bye.